Honorable Minister Atanaswe Mansarat. Speaker, sir, I rise to put forth, put forth my views on this discussion of short duration on this important issue pertaining to River, River Madhe, which is a lifeline of Goa. Speaker, sir, it is really unfortunate that this august house, which is supposed to rise above political differences and discuss issues of larger public importance, is being used to further the political agenda by a handful of people. River Madhe, as we all know, flows for about 75 odd kilometers in Goa and about 37 kilometers in Karnataka. However, in this short span, the state of Karnataka has illegally carried out civil work to the tune of nearly two to three kilometers and tried to divert the water of Madhe. The upstream part of Madhe Basin has been rightfully identified as a biodiversity hotspot filled with rare, endangered, and threatened species. The Western Ghats and an area of about 1,59,000 square kilometers has been classified as global ecological hotspot. This is an area which is rich in endemic plants, species, and unfortunately has already lost more than 70% of its original habitat and is under severe imminent threat due to human pressure. The Madhe watershed houses various five wildlife centuries, wherein Dr. Salim Ali bird century is present in Tiswari Taluka. The proposed diversion by Karnataka will cause severe and irreparable loss and damage to the forest, wildlife, and other organic life residing within and around the Madhe Basin. Apart from drinking water, this river is also a necessity for flora and fauna at the entire Raven river basin, and it is our prime duty put to put these ecological concerns on priority even ahead of our human consideration. In the interest of the livelihood of the people of Goa, who depends on the waters of the Madai River for their very survival, no diversion of Madai waters should be allowed. If the waters of the Madai River are allowed to be diverted, it would result in severe ecological damage to the already fragile Madai Basin. It will be final nail in the coffin for thousands of species, which are the caps of extinction in this area. The Madai River is a tidal estuary, which acts as an extended arm of the sea with tidal sea water intrusion. However, the fresh water flows, flow keeps the salinity at certain acceptable levels. Diversion, if allowed, would result in salinity ingress from the sea leading to massive repercussion and thereby destroying the en entire aquatic ecosystem. Speaker, sir, any diversion of the water of River Madhe would alter the nature of Kazan lands unique to the state of Goa and will also pose an irreparable threat to agriculture development in this region. Therefore, Speaker, sir, it is my humble submission that the interest of Goa and Goans in this matter may be safeguarded by way of ensuring the following. A. Expediting the setting up of Madhe Water Management Authority. And B. Following up with the Central Water Commission of the Ministry of Jal Shakti, Government of India, to withdraw the approval granted to the latest DPR of the KNN Limited Government of Karnataka. Thank you, Speaker.